opening with the king's pawn controls the center and opens up the light squared bishop and queen, often leading to sharp games. The French defense prepares for d5, but blocks in the light squared bishop in exchange for a strong center and counter attacking chances. d4 grabs full control of the center and opens up the dark squared bishop. d5 is a counter attack in the center that threatens the e4 pawn. And c3 defends the e4 pawn and pressures the d5 pawn. Bb4 pins the knight on c3, preventing it from moving or protecting e4, and threatens to trade, disrupting white's pawns after bxc3. Ne2 develops the knight to where it can recapture on c3 and avoid doubled pawns, but at the cost of blocking in the light squared bishop. Dxe4 captures the e4 pawn and controls the d3 and f3 squares. A3 attacks the bishop on b4, forcing black to either capture the knight on c3 or retreat. b7 retreats the bishop to a central square. Nxe4 captures the pawn on e4 and places the knight on a center square where it controls many important squares. Nf6 develops the knight toward the center, attacks the knight on e4 and prepares castling. Qd3 develops the queen toward the center and protects the knight. It is the last book move. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. It is excellent. This is not the best. It is an inaccuracy. This misses a better way to develop a knight off its starting square. It is an inaccuracy. Castling develops a rook, while also getting the king to safety. By castling to the opposite side of the board as the opponent, the game will tend to be more double-edged. It is excellent. The game was close to equal, but now white has the advantage. It is an inaccuracy. There was only one good move in that position. This permits the opponent to capture the checking knight. It is a mistake. Takes back. It is best. That's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. It is good. This overlooks an opportunity to threaten winning a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. This protects an underdefended pawn that is under attack. It is best. This lets the opponent capture a pawn to win material. It is an inaccuracy. Capturing that pawn wins material. This threatens to create an X-ray attack through two pieces. It is best. This wins time by threatening a bishop and forcing it to move away. It is best. This ignores an opportunity to win a tempo by threatening a queen. It is an inaccuracy. Very precise. It is best. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is best. This misses an opportunity to threaten winning a bishop. It is a mistake. The pawn is now adequately defended. It is best. This is an equal trade. It is excellent. Recaptures. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This wins a tempo by threatening a rook and forcing it to move away. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This wins a tempo by threatening a queen and forcing it to move away. It is best. This threatens to win material. It is an inaccuracy. This overlooks an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This is the strongest option. It is best. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is excellent. This threatens to force eventual checkmate. It is an inaccuracy. This moves the pawn to safety. This threatens to kick a knight. It is best. The opposing rook is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is best. This threatens to win a knight. It is a mistake. This is the only move that works. This took advantage of a mistake and white now has a winning advantage. It is a great move. Takes back. It is best. This steps away from the checking queen. It is best. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is best. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This overlooks an opportunity to activate a rook by getting it to the 7th rank. 
This permits the opponent to reveal an attack on a pawn. It is a mistake. This reveals an attack on a pawn. This is the only move that works. This was a game changing move, black is no longer in a losing position. It is a great move. This move puts the queen on a safer square. This threatens to take an open file with a rook. It is excellent. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This blocks the attack on a pawn that could have been captured. It is best. This is an equal trade. This is the only move that works. It is best. This ignores a better way to recapture a piece. It is a mistake. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. This threatens to win a pawn. It is excellent. This takes an open file, a common method for activating a rook. This threatens to fork pieces. It is good. This threatens to reveal an attack on a queen while also checking the king. It is an inaccuracy. This allows the opponent to create a passed pawn. It is a mistake. This missed a move that would have produced a winning advantage. This misses an opportunity to create a passed pawn. It is a miss. Equality is within reach, but this move doesn't get there. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is a miss. This is the only move that works. This took advantage of a mistake and black now has a winning advantage. This threatens to play checkmate. It is a great move. This stops the opponent from being able to play checkmate. It is best. Takes back. This is the start of the end game and black is winning. It is best. This is a fair move. It is good. An active king is critical in the end game and getting it off of the back rank is the first step. It is good. There were worse moves, but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. This move puts the pawn on a safer square. It is good. That's fine. It is good. This forks multiple pieces. It is excellent. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. A solid choice. It is excellent. This evades the check from the queen. It is best. That's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. It is good. Right on target. It is best. This ignores an opportunity to offer an equal trade of pieces. It is an inaccuracy. This evades the check from the queen. It is good. This is a fair move. It is good. This misses a better way to offer an equal trade of pieces. It is an inaccuracy. This moves the queen to safety. This threatens to force eventual checkmate. It is best. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is best. This misses a much better move. It is a mistake. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is excellent. This misses a better way to recapture a piece. It is a mistake. This threatens to win a pawn. It is best. This steps away from the checking queen. It is best. That's fine. It is good. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. This is not the best. It is an inaccuracy. This threatens to force eventual checkmate. It is excellent. This prevents the opponent from being able to win a rook. It is best. This ignores a better way to reveal an attack on a rook. It is an inaccuracy. This defends the attacked rook. It is best. This steps away from the checking queen. It is excellent. Very precise. It is best. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is best. This captures a queen that checked the king. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Recaptures. It is best. That pawn was free for the taking. It is best. A very strong play. It is excellent. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. Takes back. It is best.
the past pawn moves towards its goal. It is best. One of the best moves. It is excellent. This defends the attacked pawn. It is excellent. This evades the check from the rook. It is excellent. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. Sharp a back and forth game where both players had chances. That game was pretty competitive. White played a bit better than black in the opening. Black found some nice moves in the middle game. The players battled pretty evently in the end game.